All right, guys, we're going to start the build now of uh, the Alex Moss um, third gimbal board. Um, what I've done is I've found a couple of GST connectors that I'll be using in the build. Um, as I have one of these already on the board, so I'll be able to plug the board, the main board, uh, the gimbal board, into this one here, um, which that will be soldered on there, and then this one will be soldered on as well, and that then will in turn go to the battery power distribution board, as I've said. So we'll set them aside first, and what we'll do is I'm going to solder these black connectors in place first. And uh, when I've done that, I'll come back and show you that. Okay, back in a second. Okay, as you can see, we have now soldered those connectors on. So, what I'll do now is solder corresponding pins. So the board will sit like that. So I'll do that, put the pins on, and then uh, on this one, um, we'll come back and show you when we finish that. Okay, guys, soldered in the pins now for the top plate. Um, just got to add the the power now. Um, the only thing I have noticed, I'm um, hoping it's not going to affect, is this corner here. I don't know if you can see that, but when I was soldering it, it changed colour and the pad has come off. I'm not quite sure why. I'm hoping it's not going to affect it. We'll soon find out. If um, it does in any way, obviously, I will contact Paul at Flyduino and uh, ask him for a replacement top part. Anyway, we'll uh, solder the JST cables on here now, and uh, then we should be good to uh, put it all together and um, test it out. Bye in a second. Okay, guys, um, soldered on the JST connectors, male and female. Obviously, female will go to the controller board, um, the, the brushless gimbal Alex uh, to power it and then this one here will go to the power distribution board or spare bar excuse me battery that uh, whichever way as I said before you've got your system configured. One thing I have noticed is the single pins that you get um, you need five for this side and you need as you can see, three for there kind of for connecting your motor. But when you break off the five for here, you're left with two. So obviously somebody can't count. Just as well I have a spew if you spare. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put right angle ones on. So I'll fit this three right angled uh, that I believe you should get in the kit anyway, but it's not, obviously. Uh, we'll fit these and we'll get back to you in a second. Okay guys, we've uh, finished soldering on the pins for the motor, for the yaw. We have put on the sockets to accept the pins for the power board. That We have put the JS cables on as well. So what we need to do now is clip these two together like so and there you have it so what we'll do then is we will obviously connect this one to the board I believe the as I said the oh brain dead the sensor goes in here and then that then plugs into your uh, 
Alex Moss main controller board and so we'll connect this up we'll test it and we'll get back to you thanks for watching guys